Governor for CIA, Mr. William O'Duol, is being vilified for personifying the politics of Nya for actually personifying people who want independence from the politics that Nyanza has been for the last seven years. Mr. Speaker, it cannot be that a professional, a member of the Ice Park, a man who has worked with Safaricom, a man who has worked with Microsoft for more than 30 years, that now that his deputy governor is all of a sudden corrupt. Mr. William Odol is not being in public service for the first time. He's neither being in leadership for the first time. So what we're actually seeing is an attempt to fix him. And governors my, my, uh, should actually be aware that when you are elected with your deputy, you are actually like CMS twins. You cannot be separated. So it cannot be that when you're looking for votes, you want the deputy governor's support. And when they are being uh, put on the spot, you now want to drop them. This actually shows that whatever we are seeing here is not about the impeachment charges that have actually been brought. It's more than what we are seeing. If I quote Franklin Roosevelt, he actually says, in politics, nothing happens by accident. What's happening in CIA is not by accident, and the Senate has an opportunity to actually rubbish some of those claims. They must be substantial. The Senate should not be used as a conveyor belt of listening to rumors and hot air allegations. This is a substantive house which should listen to matters that are substantive and give fair hearing, fair hearing to what people who are brought order, to this Senator house. Osoti. Mr. Senator Speaker. Esi, there is a point of order. What is the, is the point, point of order, order? Senator Esi? Mr. Speaker, I rise on uh, standing order number 105. It's very unfortunate for uh, Honorable Ukenyuri, whom I have known uh, for many years, to insinuate that we are acting on rumors when, Honorable Speaker, we have a report with us done by a committee of this House and tabled before this House. Is she in order, Mr. Speaker? Can she substantiate? Senator Essie, to that extent, you're out of order. What is before us is a report. So we're not debating uh, street talk or things that were heard outside there. The committee sat, prepared a report, tabled that report, and this debate is all about that report, not rumors. Uh, Mr. Speaker, I stand guided, and I hope my few minutes uh, that I was left with to conclude are still there. Mr. Speaker,